what's going on guys welcome back to a brand new video and today we are heading to wayne county speedway in wayne city illinois so today this video is going to showcase the extreme outlaw midget series it's going to showcase all the regular classes at wayne county i said it right this time because i screwed up this recording when i said that the last time and i said sir by mistake <laughs> which um i'll probably post a blooper reel from this video so just to let you know, but that'll be posted another day, because right now, it's recording. I'm recording it on my phone, so. Anyways, but um, you'll probably see a blooper reel. But anyways, guys, Kyle Bush, Chase Briscoe, and Ricky Stenhouse Jr. was all in attendance. Ricky and Chase were racing the midgets, and Kyle was racing a micro, and Kyle's son, Braxton, who we have showcased on this channel before, and... Him in Victory Lane at Wayne County last year is actually one of the thumbnails from the video that we showcased him in. And, um, I don't think we showcased... Brett, did we show... I don't know. I have to look. But, um, he'll be in the video as well. His car racing around the track will be in there as well. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and stop blabbing because I've recorded this introduction too many damn times. So anyways, guys, I will see you at a track near you. I hope you guys enjoy the video. And until next time, see you again soon. Bye for now. guys I got the fit all good let's head to the track but then, yeah now we're filling coolers now um, he's got his monsters and other crap and I've got my water but um, yeah just a quick little look at what looks like <laughs> real quick around us I broke it no, I didn't. that's I out didn't. of a Casey's you gotta love a good old Casey's right <laughs> what the heck was that? I don't know. <laughs> but anyways, well, we're going to hit the road here shortly. Time to check uh, the trailer lights. All right, ready? Good. 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 Yep, let's hit the road. Let's hit the road, boys. Did. Yes. <laughs> There's a plane over there, and the interstate's right there, and that must be scary as all crap if you're driving on that interstate and a plane's landing. I don't think I could imagine that. We're good. What? We're good. Can you just imagine that plane was landing? Oh, Can you just imagine the fact if you're driving on that darn interstate? Just freaking, and a plane yeah. just scares the absolute crap out of you. And also next to the Veterans uh, Airport at the uh, at, in Marion. Oh, I see it down there. Yeah, I mean it's it would be the yeah, same yeah. kind of a uh, vibe like if you did that did it at Marion or whatever. It's good. All right, let's get back on the road now. We just have to check our straps in the trailer, so let's get out of here. All right, everybody, in this clip, we were just getting on I-64, and there was too much talking, so I had to mute it. But um, So we were getting on I-64, heading to Wayne County. Um, this is kind of the normal way we usually take it to go up there is through the interstate. So up next, you're going to see a really great time lapse that I recorded with my phone. So I hope you guys enjoyed the time lapse.
you guys. We have made it to Wayne County finally. I hope you guys enjoyed that time lapse. I just thought I'd just do something different in the videos. So, anyways, let's go get a pit walk started and get to work. Y'all, we're about to start to hot laps here in a little while, but. I'm on cloud nine because not only is Kyle Bush, Chase Briscoe, who I'm not seen yet, um, Ricky Stenhouse Jr. here, I just spotted Kyle Larson here as well. I just, I don't know what to say. This is going to be a good night, I can tell you that. Um, there's Kyle's car over there. There's Kyle Bush's car over here. You could, I don't know if you can see him for your Brexit on a four-wheeler. I get get a closer shot of the of Kyle's car maybe. I'm gonna try. But um yeah, it's gonna it's already a big night as it is. I don't know how many colors are here. I haven't checked my race pass yet. Um but I'm sure tonight's gonna be a good one. Um, we'll have some infield shots and um, yeah, let's get the show on the road.
started last chance showdown for the midgets, but um, I unfortunately I'm just decided that I'm not going to put any interviews for the NASCAR drivers in here in this video. I decided because hey guys, um, real quickly uh, as I'm editing this video and all that, I'm noticing some mistakes in the videos that were recorded. This is one of them. A little skip there at the you just saw if you caught it. Um, <clears throat> I don't know what's up with that. I don't know. I guess my GoPro was like, um, trying to make, I guess my GoPro was almost out of storage or something and was trying to conserve, conserve it or something. I, I really don't know. Um, I noticed it did that with the video earlier, so I apologize for that cut. But what I said was, uh, something about me interviewing Kyle Bush. When I asked him, he respectfully declined. So that's why, that's what I said. So I'm going to go into detail on um, how um, when you go and ask somebody for an interview, um, you'll either get they accept, get an, two, either one or two answers. You, they accept or they decline. And in my case, with Kyle Bush, he declined. And so that when I decided that, I realized it was not really an appropriate time to actually do anything. So, but anyways, I, I go into detail. I, I explain what I'm saying, what I'm, what I'm saying right now here in just a second so yeah I thought I'd just provide some context to what I said congratulations on the pole at for an NASCAR race obviously and then asked him for an interview and then I he did respectfully declined which is okay um, when I think about it it's probably not the, best, the most appropriate time so that's something when you're a journalist like me you gotta understand the difference between a the understanding the difference of um, when it's appropriate time to ask somebody for something like that. We get over behind this truck. When it's the appropriate time to do something like that, or in an inappropriate time, and what I did was an inappropriate time, which is all right. Uh, I make mistakes like that sometimes, and just gotta take the learn, take them up, and learn them. Um, but I do appreciate Kyle for respectfully saying no, and. Um, yeah, thought I'd just let you guys know that, and um, hopefully I can get out there in time to shoot the last chance showdown, I hope. But none of the midgets are in the staging yet, so... Anyways, let's get going with this.
Christ, it's a lot of people.
Anyways, guys, this could be the end of the video. I hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. Uh, sorry I didn't get any interviews with Trace Briscoe, Ricky Stenhouse Jr., and Kyle Busch. Uh, it's just, yeah, I just decided to change my mind last minute. So, anyways, guys, until the next video, I'll see you again soon. Bye for now.